All right, so we got GTA 5, 29 secrets and Easter eggs. First of all, before we get into the video, thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Uh, it, it's been very overwhelming for the past uh, few days, few weeks, few months, whatever you guys want to say. Thank you guys so much. I just wanted to say that. I just want to express my gratitude. Um, and this video was 10 years ago. Shout out to IGN. Shout out to GameSpot. Shout out to anybody else that was, that was around 10 years ago whenever, you know, gaming was very new uh you know to youtube and stuff like that so yeah this is this is, yeah so if the video looks like a little uh rinkity dinkity then it was 10 years ago my bad listen shout out to ign this video was 10 years We've ago already covered grand theft auto 5's impressive oh my god look at the graphics that make the world feel alive and compel players to explore we thought th but listen this incredible level of detail has another ben i never pause it but we thought this was ground shaking like graphics back then we like we thought this was like bro like GTA 5 on the PS3, like now that we have like on the PS4, and PS5 and stuff like that, like it was it was always amazing. You guys know I, I never pause the video, so this is very rare right now. Um, we thought those graphics, like you know, on the PS3 and, 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 and Xbox 360, we thought those graphics were like, bro, we thought like, <laughs> we thought like we've just like cracked the code in humanity, like when we seen those graphics. Uh, but now that we got them like on a PS5 and an Xbox uh, Series S and stuff like that, we're like, uh. We're like dang okay and like, it as well we look but we look back we're like uh, star north to slyly slip in oh the alien referencing dozens of real world movies games and tv shows make subtle nods to their own previous oh, works i know about that one incorporate the supernatural the world of grand theft auto 5 is so huge that despite over 10 million players putting in hundreds of millions of hours new easter eggs are still being discovered or being investigated like this one that seems to allude to a jetpack that can be obtained. That said, here's 29 fantastic GTA 5 secrets right, and Easter eggs that we've found. Let's go. We can't wait to find more. I'm excited, man. This video was 10 years ago. The special and collector's edition of Grand Theft Auto 5 comes with a map that has a bunch of messages hidden on it. Once exposed to a black light, you can easily see them. During the mission what? Hood Safari, you go to Grove Street, an important location in GTA San Andreas. Yep. On your way there, you can see characters on bikes that look like CJ, Big Smoke, Aww. and Smoke. You just a liability, CJ. Just Off a liability. Of the near the northwestern point of the map, you'll find a famous scene from the movie No Country for Old Men reenacted. You'll even get some free cash for your trouble. Yeah, wow. I did this before. You are a dead man. There is a machine that can be found at some construction sites that has the exact same paint scheme as Claptrap from Borderlands. I can't really? At a suburban clothing store, you can purchase a goofy looking Hawaiian shirt. If you also give Michael the free wood haircut, add a full beard, and throw on a pair of Rimmer's steel aviators, he closely resembles Max Payne from Max Payne 3. Wait, what? An assassin must have committed an execution, <laughs> your brother. I oh, I'm heading over now. You can Twins. visit a location that's an obvious nod to the Playboy Mansion, complete with a grotto and oh. topless girl. Is that Hugh Hefner? Is that Every Hugh Hefner? Okay. PM, a Thelma and Louise reenactment takes place on a cliff at the southwest corner of Mount Chiliad. We don't think they survived the end of that movie. Yeah, I don't think they survived that either. In GTA Online, one of your parents can be John Marsden, a popular character from another Rockstar game, Red, Red Dead. Dead Redemption. Red Dead. In the ocean, you can find what many believe to be the hatch from Lost. Wait, what? A jacket can be purchased at a discount store near Trevor's Landing Strip that is a nod to the one worn by the protagonist in the movie Drive. I've never watched the There's movie a Drive There's a very before. obvious Halo parody at the Oriental yeah, Movie uh, Theater where you can everyone see knows a this. street performer dressed as Master Chief. Everyone knows this. <laughs> Posters and records from Mad Dog and OG Loke Records can be found in Franklin's house on the hill. This is another nod to characters from Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Floyd's apartment has the same layout as Melanie's apartment in Quentin Tarantino's Jackie Brown. Wait, what? Lester's house has a lot of pop culture nods such as statues resembling Master Chief, an anime spoof figure called Princess Robot Bubblegum, and a poster that seems to be a nod to the popular X-Files poster. Yeah, but he has like, his During room is just creepy. Mission, you can drive your vehicle under the bridge and see an alien frozen in the ice. Yeah, that's nice. That's sick. Speaking of aliens, you can find a UFO underwater near the northernmost point of the map. Wait, what? I didn't even know There's that. three additional UFOs that can be seen after 100% completion of the game. The FIB. can be seen near Sandy Shores. Where are you, assholes? The second UFO can be seen above Fort Zancudo. 
Brother, this man, this man is firing a UFO. And the third can be seen above Mount Chiliad, but only during a thunderstorm. Why do they, they have F5 vehicles in the game for a story mission? At one point, you bring a vehicle to the garage that has a black light list on the wall of the remaining vehicles. These are all nods to the movie Gone in 60 Seconds. Really? Brucey Kibitz, a character from Grand Theft Auto 4, has a website where he sells performance enhancing drugs. He also makes appearances okay. in the online portion of the game. Hey, what's up? In the middle of the wilderness, you will find a tap dancing hillbilly, which is a reference to the real world tap dancing hillbilly, Jesco White. Really? There's graffiti from the Mystery 8 Killer all over the world of Grand Theft Auto 5. Each clue leads to another until you find one final message in the prison at cell block 9A that tells where he hid the bodies. You can even find them if you go to the location and oh. swim underwater. Oh, no, I'm if not finding nothing. If you look the first clue, you'll find a newspaper clipping that says the killer died in prison. Oh, yeah, I'm not. No, Franklin's I'm not. bookshelf has a book on it called Red Dead by Jay Marston. This is another nod to Red Dead Redemption really? and the game's main character, John Mars. Bro, Franklin, do not read no books. Random face can be found in the mountains. Some people think that it's Jesse Pinkman from Breaking Bad, but we think it's more likely one of the developers of the game. <laughs> the mask that you can purchase at Vespucci Beach is said to resemble the Manhunt Mask, another popular Rockstar title. One of the random transitions you get when switching to Trevor shows him following someone on a scooter and shouting Scooter Brothers. This is a reference to a popular YouTube video made by fans of Grand Theft Auto what? 4. What? No, kill him? Wow. At one point in the story, you can see Jimmy I, looking I've at seen Nico Bellic's profile on Life Invader. I've seen this. Nico is the protagonist from Grand Theft Auto 4. Yeah, I've actually seen his this like in game. Is listed as one of his friends. The ghost of Lenora Johnson can be seen around 11 p.m. on the top I've of heard Mount about Gordon. this. Moving closer to her location will reveal the word Jack and cause her to disappear. Jack was the name of one of her suspected killers as outlined on the website whokilledlenorajohnson.com. This could be a reference to the real world belief that actress Peg Entwistle haunts Mount Lee in Los Angeles. We're guessing there's more where that came from, but so far that's I mean, 29 secrets there and might be more, eggs man. we found in Grand Theft Auto 5. For more on Grand Theft Auto 5, you know where to keep it locked. IGN. Shout out to. Boss is gonna kill me. Move! <laughs> Shout out to IGN for this video, man. Um, I really love how GTA. I mean, obviously, like how it, it's it's obviously based off of real life and stuff like that. But I love how in depth uh, like they are to like you know conspiracies and uh, like real life. You know, um, I wouldn't say. Yeah, like, you know, um, real life movie inspirations and, you know, how the devs, like, I love how the devs are in, like, how they're in tune with the internet, if that makes sense. Uh, because obviously this came out 2013 and 2013, that's when the internet was just now popping off. Obviously, like, you know, the internet's fully, like, you know, taking off, you know, we obviously. But um, this is where, like, 2013 was definitely when the internet was definitely, like, like, bumping up. At a point to where like real life and the internet was like in my opinion and back then I, wow i just said back then like an old person in my <laughs> in my opinion 2013 was like i had a mix of outside like you know video games and online um but i would say that now i'm online more but not like obviously like i I mean, I make videos and stuff like that. Like, I'm not on like Facebook all day. And if you listen, if you're if you go on Facebook, you know that that's all you. Um, but definitely back then, it was a mix of everything. Now, um, it's just like videos, and then like whenever I go like to go exercise or like play basketball or something like that, then that's obviously outside and stuff. So, um, it's definitely a mix between the two. But then back then, uh, the internet was definitely going up. But you know, the internet was just taking off at that time. You know. Um, but yeah, but I love how like GTA 5 had like the experiences like the aliens and stuff like that uh, Even though in real life, you know, we haven't really uh, Well, I don't I, listen. I don't know. I'm not really into the whole conspiracy thing But you know, we haven't really gotten any 4k just blatant like, you know footage of like a UFO and stuff like that and I also love how uh, how like the <laughs> how like the UFOs had like I, that's I just I literally just clicked on it like out of nowhere. I love how like the UFOs had like the FIB on it. You know like it, 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 the conspiracies there. Um, like I'm not really into conspiracy stuff like that, but uh, I love how GTA had like a water planet. But I also wonder what conspiracy because obviously this is ten years ago. So like bro, like everything has doubled. Everything has like listen. I don't. I've ne I never lived in like Florida or whatever. 
But I, I'm going to assume that Florida is going to have everything. That Florida is going to have all, like, all the animals. They're going to have crazy people. Um, but there's definitely, definitely aliens and stuff like that. That's going to be in the game. Uh, UFOs, that's going to be in the game as well. That thing about um, about this lady or whatever who killed, uh, what, what's her name? Le- 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 Leonora? Is that her name? How do you, L, what, what, what letter is this? Yeah, Leonora. That's an E? Why does the E look like that? Who killed Leonora? Now, if I'm being honest with you, if GTA 6 can have, like, more murders like this, because if you guys don't know, um, the stuff that happens, like, in the story in GTA, if you get in the car, the people on the news, whatever, and they'll say, uh, on a weasel news, and then they will legit tell you that, like, oh, this rapper got killed. So, for example, like, one more thing before, you know, I, I know I'm yapping right now, but I am the yap master. Um, if you guys don't remember that one mission in GTA 5 where it's you, um, I say, well, well, yeah, obviously you're controlling the players, where it's uh, Franklin, Lamar, and Trevor, where they go to, like, you know, sell drugs or whatever, turns out it was fake, and then, like, you know, they had to obviously get out, you know, get out the ballas territory and stuff like that, uh, sorry, the ballas, and then they had to go down, like, the little sewer thing, and there's, like, a rapper, and, like, some girls, they're dancing or whatever, and then, like, you, well, I didn't kill him, did I kill him? I think I did kill him. Yeah, I killed him. I think I killed him. I don't know why I killed him, but I just, I mean, like, it's GTA, so, like, you know, it's not real life. So, yeah, I think I ended up killing him, whatever. And then after the mission, like, happened or whatever, you would get in the car, and then they would say, oh, boom, on Weasel News, the rapper, I forgot his name. It's like the rapper, whatever, uh, died while filming a music video. Like, it's crazy because they were legit, like, like, it, like. It's you, like, 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 like. Whenever you're listening to it, you're like, dang, like, wait a minute, I, I, that was me, like, I killed that guy, and then you start to feel weird, like, you start to feel like somebody's watching you, even though, like, it is a part of the video game, and that's meant to happen because, like, it, it's programmed in the game, or whatever. It just feels weird because, like, it, it's just like, dang, like, I really killed that guy, and they're saying it in the car, it's crazy, but. Other than that, man, GTA 6 is going to be absolutely insane with the conspiracies, with the animals, bro. It's going to be in Florida, bro. Like, I listen. Again, never lived in Florida, but Florida is a crazy place. Like, I, I've watched it on the news, like, my whole life. Florida, a bunch of weird... Uh, I, I, listen, if you're from Florida, I don't want to make fun of you, but, like, a bunch of weird, obnoxious... Uh, obnox- I'm not going to say that word. If I say that word again, I'm going to mess up and I'm going to look dumb. A bunch of weird craziness uh, goes on in that whole state. So, um, oh, yeah, wait a minute. Now, listen, before I go, I know I'm yapping, but before I go... um. So, obviously, the whole state of Florida, they're calling it something. I forgot. Is it Leonetta? Is, is, that, the, is, that, is, is that what Florida's called in GTA 6, I think? Leonetta, I think? I don't know. Um, but legit, I think they're putting the entire state of Florida in the game. Because, obviously, like, you know, um, what do you call it? Um, it's going to be, uh, the map's going to be two times as big. We all know that. I think they're going to put the entire state of Florida in the game somehow some way because obviously the keys are in there the swamps are in there uh vice city which is miami that's going to be in there south beach that's that's like one of the first thing uh, one of the first scenes you see whenever the trailer starts that's going to be in there obviously um and i think south beach north beach uh because i think that's all one i think that's all one same beach like if you look at florida whatever it's all one beach and south beach is obviously like down at the south uh not next to the keys but like it's like kind of like it's it's southern where the keys are and then the keys are gonna are, are there as well i a little birdie right listen to me real quick listen to me it, don't say nothing you're gonna make me mess up but a little birdie has told me that the little island because i've seen like the um like and obviously you know this might not be real because i've seen like five thousand different versions of the gta 6 map but little birdie told me that uh that that we might have Cuba, that we might have Cuba in the in the game as well. Now if 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 that's right, like if you know if that's right, then cool. But if I'm wrong, then I mean I'm wrong. Like I mean I'm wrong about a game that hasn't like that hasn't came out yet. So like you know technically am I wrong? No. But uh, <laughs> but honestly though, what if Cuba's in the game? Because obviously like Cuba's literally like right under. Oh man, it's gonna be bro. It's going to be absolutely amazing. I cannot wait to GTA 6 comes out. But it's crazy. Let's give a round of, applause, round of applause to GTA 5 and, like, everything is ever offered to us. Um, other than that, you guys are going to pick some out. And...